My mother was not terribly sort of touchy and sweet, but she was tough. And um, she had to look after my father, who was always a sick man. But he was quite difficult with her. But I think he's, of the three of us, my sister, my brother and myself, I think he was the sweetest with me. <laughs> I can remember so many nice things. And, uh, and I can remember two or three nasty things as well. But sadly, my father very shortly died. And that put a great ghastly black shadow over our family. My brother, my sister, myself had to earn some money. And I was, what, I was the youngest. They were both fairly settled in the area where my father used to work, in the factory area. And then one day my mum, she, she came across a, an advert in the paper she found it in a, in a bus and um, it said children wanted for Christmas show. I was told I would, was going to be taken to see a woman who helps children become actors. And um, I think my mother thought I was uh, another Brando coming. <laughs> To become an officer in the army in wartime was, was quite difficult, but they needed officers. And so, generally speaking, they chose somebody who had, shall I say, a little bit of class, you know, rather than, than just one of the fellows. And it is important and uh, it became important. Although, in fact, it, it wasn't meant to be snobby, but um, I was chosen because I had a, a kind of bit of class. I'd learnt a bit of class. And uh, apart from the fact that I pleased them with all my answers and my, the way I behaved and what I had to say, and. And uh, I suppose that was an important part, that I also spoke properly. But my family didn't. My family remained Cockney. And, um, and it was, in a way, slightly divided us. In, but not in reality, but it did divide us a bit. As Angela Schooler, I was with her for 35 years before she died. I was very loyal, always, but she was a very tough lady. She, she wasn't well at all. And it was only after we were married for some time that I realized she had some deep problems. Uh, but I stayed with her for 35 years in spite of it. And, uh, and then, of course, the tragedy of the end of it. That was real tragedy. I'll never get over it.